Hi guys. I picked this up in a charity shop quite a long time ago and I keep bringing it downstairs and looking at it, thinking about doing a project with it and then I decide it's too much work and put it back again. It's wire controlled. Steering. Bit slow. Uh, also, these doors open. I'm not quite sure when they're supposed to open because there's some mechanism in there. Whether they're supposed to open as it goes along. Oh, we've got two extra buttons here. Ah, that's what it is. Yeah, looks like they're supposed to open somehow. No, I can see it's like a servo arm in there. You probably can't see it. Not just be pushing them open and closed. Bat Hero Gold Blaster. Right. So, if I wasn't, if I was going to do anything with it, what was it I was going to do? Well, <laughs> what I was going to try and do was fix the fact it's missing a wheel and that um, pivot point is broken. Now, I keep looking in all my bits and pieces and I don't have another wheel that is exactly that size. So I think what I'll have to do, these ones are close, but they're not spot on identical size, but they're close and they probably look all right. So I might make up some 3D print some hubs for these to go on. 3D print suitable pivots to go on there and 3D print something that will go over the top of there and down the side to replace the bit that's broken. So it's a fairly involved project to be honest. Well, in the scheme of things, for me anyway. Uh, let's think, that probably wants to go that way around, doesn't it? Yeah. So, yeah. So that's the plan. Don't know how long it'll take me. This is the introductory bit of the video, and then we'll have a look at it, see what I can 3D print, and then if I can sort out the steering, then we'll have a look and see if we can sort out the opening doors at the same time. No idea how old it is. I don't think there's any manufacturer's name on it anywhere. Oh yeah, there is. Uh, although I have no idea what that... KS Toys. don't know if the camera's picking that up. Oh, there we are. That should be it. KS Toys. No idea how old it is. I don't know what batteries it's got in it. It feels quite heavy. I'll leave it as it is for now. I'll take some measurements and see what we can do about 3D printing the pivot and hubs, etc. Right guys, first update on trying to fix this bat hero. I've designed and printed that wheel hub. It's not the finished article, but it's my first attempt. So that should slide over there in there I need to get that over there so yeah that fits mm, might trim it a little bit there been a bit too generous with the thickness of that edge there 
but that's uh, that's workable. That's uh, that's okay. That piece there. What I'm trying to do is design it so it will fit in there. I have to trim off the broken bit a little bit. I don't know if you can see this clearly enough. Let's bring it in closer. Right, that's the broken bit. So the idea of that is that will go into that gap there. And if we just trim that broken bit a little bit, that should fit in there and replace the bit that's missing. If we don't drop it inside and lose it. Holes, holes a bit small, twice in a row. But that's because I just guessed it. Actually, no, it probably is the right size. That's the elephant's foot that's actually filled it in. My stomach just rumbled then. Did you hear it? I don't know if the camera would have picked that up or not. It must be getting close to lunchtime, evening meal time, whatever you want to call it. I get completely confused as to what to call it nowadays. I always used to call it tea time. Yeah, I can either trim that a bit more or trim them off a little bit. And I reckon that will just glue in there nicely. Yeah, I think I'll just file the edge of that off so that'll fit. Okay, so that's first update. Oh, just a little bit more. I've just filed that little bit. And that now fits in there absolutely perfectly. I'm so pleased with that. I think I will actually glue that and glue and clamp it in place and leave it. If I need to enlarge that hole, I can just drill it out. Yeah, rather pleased with that. Obviously that's thicker than that piece, which means I've got to make the pivot piece that's coming out through the middle there a little bit longer. But I've got to print that anyway. That's going to be all new. So Yeah, rather pleased with that at this moment in time. Thanks for watching. If you want more information, check down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. And if you want to subscribe, you can check out my channel over here. Up here is my latest video on my channel, and down here is a video playlist associated with the video you've just watched. Thanks again for watching.